But are we letting young people down? You're not going to get innovators and so on coming to a place where they can't get across the city. No, well, public transport. I think we probably are, but I suspect we're letting down most of society as well. Jamie, the editor of Chipping Naughty News, would you like to join me in the studio? Hello, Ed. <laughs> That's incredible. So you've just, you're, all you've got there is a simple camera in a green screen studio with a green desk in front of you sitting at home. And actually, we're not even using a, a, a high you know, volume video line, high data line for this. What, what are you doing already? I noticed you've already sort of had the wings in the oven to cook them. We have. We've cooked the wings in the oven and then we're just going to do what you love best, Steve, which is to reverse sear them. Yeah, sounds um, great. We are going to be adding some peanut butter. Now you can use any but nut butter you want. The, these targeted monoclonal antibodies are uh, found to reduce uh, the evident features of cytokine-driven hyperinflammation. What should that be spent on, Tim? What do, you, what do you want to see as the way forward? You know, you, you'll no doubt accept Dan's point. He can't fix it for everybody. And some of these services will have to go. But what, what, what do you want to see happening in the near future? Weight by weight, this is one tenth of potatoes. It's so incredible. The potato is 20 grams of carbs, sugar uh, per 100 grams. This is two grams, or two to three grams per 100. And uh, it tastes better. It's healthier. It's got vitamin C in there. It's got vitamin B6 in. Anyway, I only knew a few chords, but I sang some of the songs I knew, and I sang along yeah. with wonderful Les, and all the postmen loved it. And there was a guy from the club watching it and said, do you want to do a show in the club tonight? Yeah. System, frankly, mm. I really am confident about that, despite the challenges that we're facing. But what we've got to do is, Tim talked about a, a vicious circle. We've got to create a virtuous circle. Well, let's now go to Jamie in our interactive hub opposite St Paul's. Jamie, what are people saying around the country? Well, honestly, it's a very, very mixed bag. We've got some quite strong opinions from people who have been quite upset with their local GP surgery. And then, But what do you think rice is doing when we consume rice? Panel, let's have a guess on the rice. We've got 20 teaspoons, we've got 10 teaspoons, we've got 20 teaspoons, we've got 4 teaspoons, we've got 15 teaspoons. Well, well, the answer is, I've got 8 as well. Uh, the answer is 150 grams, which is what we've got in this little dish here. And it's just so much, I can't believe it. I'm going to check it three times. Uh, 10 teaspoon equivalent of sugar. Cinemas. Chips are probably the biggest sort of discovery for myself. I hadn't even heard of Solaria till I was about 45 years old. Yeah. Seriously. And then when I meet people, I go, you don't know what a Solariac is. OK, thank you very much indeed for that. I want to bring in Professor Smith here. Um, clearly, uh, we've heard a lot there from, from the other two, two experts. For you, though, what would um, typical treatment pathways look like? So if we're trying to bring everyone together, and, and we heard Professor Cardell say there, you know, it's about the depression. It's about all of those things that sometimes we as clinicians Thank you very much. So we can start with, um, first of all, by the way, I got into trouble for this uh, off kind a little go at me. I, I said recently, but I'm going to say it again because I stand by it, the most nutritional part of the donut, the hole. <laughs>